Are your video edits missing that professional touch? Do you want to add a smooth, eye-catching transition that grabs viewers' attention? If the answer is yes, you are in the right place. Hello and welcome to JFX Capture. My name is Shazad and today I'm going to take you through a template that I've taken from Envato Elements for how to use transitions in Premiere Pro. This is one of the latest transitions templates in Envato Elements, and I'll take you through all the steps that you need to implement that in your videos. Envato Elements has tons of incredible templates that you can use in all your applications, including Premiere Pro, After Effects, Final Cut, Apple Motion, and so much more. Check out the link in the description below to explore what Envato has to offer, and also save on your subscription while leveling up your game. Now, let's dive into the video and transform your videos. So once you've downloaded the transition pack into your PC or Mac, unzip it in your desired location, go to Premiere Pro, go to your project and then on your timeline you should have your footage already I suppose and then what you're going to do is go to file and then go to open project, go to the project uh, that you've just downloaded and click on the wipe and light transitions. Now what you're going to do is you can either check in here, basically you can check the effect of each transition in this um, in these compositions but if you already know what you want you can simply just go to your you can just go to your own original sequence so I'll go back to my original sequence 01 over here and all you can do is simply you go to your transitions you can either go to the car transitions, lamp and urban, and I suppose you've already checked which one you want. So I'm going to go to the car lights. Just before you bring your transitions onto your timeline, just make sure that the nested sequence is switched off, okay? Otherwise, these transitions is not going to work. So make sure that is off. This is now on. That's off. And simply go on here and bring your transition over the your timeline so what we're going to do now is we can just adjust this slightly over there and now you're going to see the actual transition taking place so if i play the video just now you will see let's have a look okay there you go and what you can also do, because I'm using the 4K resolution, what you can do is simply go to the effect controls of this transition and scale up to 200. So that's going to be like something like this. There you go. Okay, you can try another one if you like. So you delete this one and I'm going to delete the audio with it. And we can go to something else like, for example, this one here. and then I'll just put it in between the two. So transition, oh, again, I'm just gonna put it to 200. There you go, okay. Of course, this one looks like you're just putting a, a video on top of another video. Yes, it does look like it, but in this pack, th the way they've done it, the way this creator has done it is actually just creating a, a video file for it. So um, this is also fine. A lot of people use it. Um, there's nothing wrong with it. It just depends on what your preference is. So now I'm going to go to another one, which is probably the lamp transitions, and I'm going to go to lamp light zero two and put it on my in between the next two videos so i'm gonna put it over there and again as i said if your project is 4k then put the scale to 200 and you should be fine so let's try this now there you go okay so it's very nice it looks really really nice and then what i can show you is in the last one for the last video I'm just gonna go to something like the urban wipe 010 or oh, sorry 10 and we can put it over there so again as I said make it to 200 because the resolution is 4k and then we can simply play there you go 
Okay, so this is all done. It's really nice and easy and you can really create a compelling, really catchy videos um, with these transitions. So go and have a look in the Envato. The link is in the description below. And if you have any questions, please put it in the comments below and I will try my best to reply. Thank you so much. Until the next video, look after yourself. Bye-bye.